Hello, I'm Mediocre Montgomery, and uh, today. <laughs> Day unknown of the COVID boogaloo. Please, Fortnite gamers, rate my rig. I would like to prove to Meredith and her punk ass dad that I am not a loser and that I am worthy to take her to prom. I had plenty of toilet paper, but my rations grew scarce, so I just started eating the toilet paper. Honestly, not bad though. It washes down pretty good with some vinegar. A pretty nutritious meal. I'm Mediocre Montgomery, and welcome back to the Mediocre Militia. Contrary to uh, popular belief, Christians are off their fucking rockers. Breaking news. A stunted effigy of the Lord Jesus Christ was found in Colombia, and it was, <laughs> it, was <laughs> it was on a tree this time. Uh, look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the... F <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> Top of his head. The fuck happened to your arm, mate? Did you give it to the poor to wipe their asses with? It's not exactly toilet paper, but I suppose if you use the nails, you could get the job done pretty well. This is God. All jokes aside, clasping your hands together and mumbling at the floor doesn't actually do anything. I know, it's a shocker. But. Kenneth Copeland has a much better approach. COVID-19! COVID-19! I blow! The wind of God! The wind of God! On you. On you. You are destroyed forever. You are destroyed forever. And you'll never be back. And you'll never be back. Welp, I'm sold. I just have to blow the fart, sorry. The wind of God on the COVID virus. Oh wait, no, no I don't. He's already vanquished it. You are destroyed forever. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. The US now leading the world in deaths with the coronavirus claiming more than 20,000 American lives. Also, Solid Rock Pastor targets reaction to church's Sunday sermons despite COVID social distancing policies. Excellent. Pastor Lawrence Bishop II told his sheeple, and I quote loosely, for the sake of time, no one is faulting the people packed in lows, elbow to elbow, with a, with a two hour wait to get in. It's not the people at bars that hate on us and attack us, it's the other Christians or churches, yada yada yada. But I say the scripture that says, Forsake not to assemble yourselves together more so when you see the end is near. If this is not the beginning of the end, then I don't know what is. Wow. I don't know why Lawrence is freaking out. Kenny Boy already blew the cock of God. Sorry, blew the wind of God, and vanquished it. Suck his dick, just like you said you were gonna do. By the way, people are faulting, you know, people at Lowe's and at bars and stuff. Because, I don't know if you already know this, but viruses 
proliferate through close proximities of infected people. Being in a church doesn't make you immune, biatch. Also, if you stopped congregating, this wouldn't even be the beginning of the end. You're gonna feel real silly when you die and meet my boy, Flying Spaghetti Monster. Bobby Henderson, looking out for you, buddy. Is that the name of the dude? Our prophet? <laughs> Our prophet, uh, I think Bobby Henderson. Kind of a quick video, but in my conclusion, Christianity has once again put an imaginary band-aid on a burn victim. You're not helping, so just stop. But if you're gonna join a church, you feel the need that it's incumbent upon you to have some sort of faith, join the Church of Satan. Because, you know, at least then people won't have a problem keeping a six-foot perimeter around you. Satan's pretty cool. I'm Comrade Montgomery. You want the numbers, Mason? I'm Mediocre Montgomery. I love you guys. Be safe. Like, sub, and share. And if you think I'm a total fucking idiot, leave a hateful comment. Those are fun. Deuces.